Well, it took him just over a year on the UFC roster to realize a piece of this UFC middleweight championship. He is the last style bender, Israel Adesanya, a guy you tried to bring in to emulate John Jones back in the day. Absolutely. You knew right away when you watched Israel fight that he has an ability to fight in so many different ways. If he's coming to play a part, he's going to play that part better than anyone else you can find. Yeah. It's because of the adaptability. It's his ability to change the way that he's fighting based on his opponent. In the Derek Brunson fight, he did a lot of knee because he knew Brunson was going to wrestle him. But in the fight against Kelvin Gastelum was a lot of punches and kicks because the wrestling threat was not so great. You gotta have that if you hope to compete and stay atop your division for a long time. All right, so here he is on this night or any other. He's one of the best heavyweights in the world, the former champion, Stipe Miocic. How about the wins list? Francis Ngannou Jr., Dos Santos, Alistair Overeem, and he's looking to reel in another big one here tonight, DC. And every one of those guys was him defending the championship, John. That goes to tell you the murderer's row that he had to go through to hold on to that UFC heavyweight championship. A phenomenal boxer, a phenomenal wrestler, great cardio, and the new breed of heavyweights that has shot to the top of the world, Steve Amiel. Amazing to think where he was after his first UFC main event against Stefan Struve in 2012 has been largely perfect ever since. All eyes on Steve A yet again here too. And now our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Miocic is six years his senior. He weighed in at 240 pounds. The reach is the same. And with the official introductions, here is the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, only a professional record of 20 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya! And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 20 wins, three losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of Independence, Ohio, Stipe Miocic! You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch gloves and we are underway. All right, so here we go. Round one is underway. Very compelling matchup for fight fans around the world. And going to be very interesting to see how soon the grappler goes for the takedown. Well, he's going to try to get the takedown right away. But when he shoots that shot, when he changes that level, he is going to be shooting into a guy that truly understands all aspects of mixed martial arts. I'm wondering how, if his first shot doesn't work, does he approach trying to get this fight to the ground? Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Beautiful punch. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, beautiful land there by Adesanya. You hear this crowd just eating out of his hand, oohing and on every time he advances. I mean, he just captures your imagination from the walkout to the entrance when he's in the octagon, the fighting style. He just kind of has that thing that makes you want to stop and stare at Israel Asanya. All right, so we have got a full-on brawl to start this fight. Any code? Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. All 
Hardy is very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the game. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. All right, well, his hooks have been a big storyline in this one, and there it is again. So just when you thought maybe the opponent had made the requisite adjustments, he gets cracked again. He gets cracked again, and it does not take many of those hooks to end your night. Oh, man. Jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have times where I've been kicked like that. And I'm gonna tell you one thing, it does not feel good. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. Real sneaky body kick. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Stepe. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Now connects with a right. All right, you see his high-level footwork here, maybe trying to set up that hook shot again, potentially. You could tell, John, he's setting a trap. He's trying to walk his opponent back into his hook side, his big power side, so he'll keep faint, not little punches, with no intent to land, just to get his opponent where he needs him to be to land that kill shot. Two minutes remain in the round. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Just missed with the left there. And he switches to southpaw here yet again. And they separate. Miacic's hook shot gets blocked. The defense saw that one coming. Oh, he's looking to set up that head kick. No good. Nice punch by Adesanya. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Got the single collar tie. Good punch, Lance. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. 30 seconds now to go in the opening round. Oh! Big knee to the body! Just misses there with the left. Big left hand there inside. Oh, straight right. Five minutes in the books. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lots for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. All right, round two now. Stipe Miacic. And on the other side, Israel Adesanya. Oh, wow! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Nice kick. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh! Massive head kick. Oh, straight right. Beautiful connection on the feet. He's got it all working tonight, DC. He's in his zone. He's in a zone, and it's going to be very difficult for his opponent to keep up with him. 
And both guys really throwing with authority. All right, so new round, same narrative. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Get right here. Oh! Oh! Back to the feet. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the... Man. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Fight stats here, these numbers unofficial, but 61 oh, total strikes. Huge right hand! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Great punch, man. So much power. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Three minutes now to go in this one. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Lunges. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, he might be out. Let's make it close and let's get going now. Every time these guys come together, man, you just hear the, the punches and everything landing. Both, both very powerful, very, very explosive. Nice punch there. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! I mean, geez, Louise. Oh! That was a jab! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Nice punch by Adesanya. 90 seconds to go now. Wow. Oh! News hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Back to the feet. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single power oh! time. Look at that. He's in trouble. It's over. It's over. He got him! Oh, my goodness. What a fight. Yeah, a few things better in mixed martial arts than a finish by way of the elbow. It takes a lot of technique, a lot of repetitions in the gym, and you've got to have a lot of confidence in your skills to throw those elbows and try to maximize force over a short distance. Of course, when you land, it can be absolutely devastating, and in this case, it spelled the end of the night for his opponent. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Now we go inside the